Hello everyone, konnichiwa. I'm Yuka. Welcome to Yuka Japanese Cooking. Today is a little bit different. I'm going to show you Studio Ghibli's food. Do you know Studio Ghibli? Studio Ghibli is a famous Japanese movie production. You may know some of their masterpieces. Kiki's Delivery Service, Princess Mononoke, Castle in the Sky, Valley of the Winds, Porco Rosso, Spirited Away. Internationally well-known Japanese movies they produce. And today's dish is one of the iconic movie. Guess what it is? Yes! It's my neighbor Totoro, Tonari no Totoro, in Japanese. I've been watching this movie since I was a child. So I'm sure I've watched already more than 50 times. In this movie, elementary school student Satsuki makes bento box for her little sister Mei-chan and her father. It's really a simple bento since the elementary school student cooks. But I'm so excited to remake this bento today. I never thought of remake this bento in my life, but why not? So shall we make? Okay, let's get started. Here are the ingredients. While waiting, I want to introduce the recipe app that I made. Recipe by YJC contains various Japanese home-cooked recipes by text and video tutorial. New recipe is up weekly. Of course, it's free, both Android and iOS, so please download it.
So, Sasuke's bento is ready. So, let's try tasting. Itadakimasu. Looks so colorful. I'll start the beans first. Mm, the beans are very fluffy inside. And it goes well with rice. I can hear the beans popping in my mouth. And it's seasoned with salt. So, it tastes very natural. Bean flavor. Some children may not like the peels of the green peas. So, in this case, please peel. Now let's try denbu, a pink color. We usually see this pink color denbu when eating chirashi sushi on those festivals in spring. Sounds strange, but it has a good balance of sugar and fish. If your children don't like fish, this might be a good substitution. By the way, my son Kengo, he likes denbu. Okay, next. The fish head and put aside. Then eat like, like this. Grill the fish and rice. It's always good. The tail has calcium, so I eat. And last one, pickled plum. <laughs> Salty. This bento box has a very simple ingredient, but so many flavors. Salty, sweet, sour, and umami. Gochisousama deshita. Okay, so here are the tips of today's menu. Tip. I used denbu to add the pink color today. But if you can find denbu at your local supermarket, please use cuttlefish and please boil and dry it and add sugar and food coloring, the red color. Tip to boil peas, don't boil peas too long. Otherwise, surface of the peas shrink and the texture will change. And tip to make steamed rice. For this bento, please prepare the Japanese rice, which is short grain rice. So how was the video today? I was thrilled to reproduce the Sasuke's bento in the movie. If you have a request to remake the bento or food from anime, manga, and cartoons, Please let me know from the comment box down below. Would you like to know more about Japanese food and culture and family life? Please go to my food blog, yjc.tokyo. yjc.tokyo. And before watching another videos, please subscribe my channel. And then special thanks to Mario and Luigi, the toy poodles, and my helpers. And if you're interested in their daily routine, please go to my private Instagram, Yuka Togami. You'll see they are very active. Okay, everyone, see you next time.